I woke up today and realized I'm stuck in a cycle. You can't avoid being stuck in a cycle, that's the sad truth of it. I thought maybe next year I'd have a shot at breaking the current routine I'm stuck in. The only reason that sounds unappealing is I just fall into another boring routine. I guess that's what life's all about, being content with the routine you have set. I'll just break away, enjoy things a little more. It helps just taking time out of the day to appreciate the small things. Really taking everything, you know, the views, the smells, the sounds. Be aware, don't be content. Now, I'm not saying to do something different or to experience new things. Just be aware of everything around you. Try to look at things from different perspectives because perspective is reality. Right now, I feel like my perspective on living life has changed. Live life however you see fit. You know, it really bugs me when people say, oh, life is short, live it to the fullest. That makes no sense, as life is literally the longest thing you will ever experience. And whether you have money or not, just enjoy your time here. Money doesn't buy happiness. But then again, I've never seen a sad person on a jet ski. I'm basically just lecturing myself right now, but I really should listen to what I'm saying. What makes me feel happy? I guess making good grades and going to work. I enjoy listening to music and watching all the movies I can, but I don't know what to do with any of it. I guess I could be considered happy. I want to be considered happy. But I can't really do it anymore. Constantly searching for reassurance that my life actually means something, and I never find a good solid reason. Trying hard in school never made me happy. I know I'm sharp. I'm in the top 10% of my class, so I'm doing okay, and my friends care, but only when they have something to benefit from caring. My parents aren't ever around, they're always working. Regardless of feeling loved, I still feel like I can never suffice anyone as if anyone remotely involved in my life would be unimpacted by the loss of me. While they act so caring and inviting, I know that they could care less if I just suddenly fell off the face of the earth. There's nothing wrong with how they feel, I just knew if they even cared about me a little bit, they'd be honest. The only person I really even slightly trust is Jay. Friends since the beginning. We may have lost touch, but I do feel that mutual connection when we hang out or talk. That's more than I can say for all the other people in my life. I love you, Jay, and I'm so sorry. I love you guys, but I'm completely disconnected from everybody. There's not a single person that I can talk to that I can relate to. With all that being said, or written in this case, I'm ready. I'm ready to never feel like this again. I'm ready to never feel again. Uh, that's a that's 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 all I wrote.
I'm sorry. Thank you. I appreciate you coming.